Hi, you guys. Okay, let's get this done. I'm lacking my face powder, and then we can do my contour with my bronzer and my lips, and we will be done. All right, so I'm going to use the number 5 tan shade, the multitasker face powder from Milani. I'm going to use that all over my face. Um, what brush am I going to use? I'm going to use this brush right here by Echo Tools. No, I think this is from Kayla. Kayla Complexion Brush. Brush. Y'all can't talk. It's so late in the evening. Okay, this is a complexion brush from Kayla. I'm going to use it with the um face powder from Milani in the shade Tan. Okay? All right. I love Milani products, especially the face powders. I use them for, you know, to set my foundations and to bronze with. Okay, that is it. Now we're going to bronze up. And I'm going to use the number 7 dark tan face powder by Milani. And I'm going to bronze my face. It's hot. I'm going to take this brush right here. And I'm just going to bronze my face. There we go. Alright, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to bronze my, well, contour my nose. But before I do that, I'm going to take the Femme Couture Mineral Effects in the shade Neutral. And I'm just going to slightly put this just a little bit underneath my eyes. It kind of helps give that contour look, so, yeah. And it's yellow, so I like this. I really do. Been using it for a while, and I like it. Keep everything still highlighted underneath the eyes. And I like that look. Okay, with the brush that looks like this is a 6 plus brush. This is my favorite. Uh, for using contour, well, using bronzer to contour my face. I love this. 
All right, I'm going to grab the same shade, Dark Tan from Milani. Go ahead and bronze that up just a little bit darker. Just a little bit. Then I'm going to contour my nose. Rub that in. There we go. All right. There we go. This is how it's looking. All right. So now I'm going to take my blush. And the blush I'm going to use is a cream blush that I had hauled also in the um, haul that I had videotaped yesterday. And this blush is called Cover Girl Olay Simply Ageless uh, Sculpting Blush in 220. This is how it looks. It's like a lavender color, and I just love this blush. I tried it on earlier, and yes, I love it. All right, so I'm just going to put some on. The last time I used it, which was earlier today, I didn't quite put enough on there so you could really see it. But I know that with cream blushes, you have to be careful. If not, ugh, you have a mess on hand. What I mean is you can put too much on and it look real clownish. You know, like a, you know, clownish. Okay, that's enough. I'm not going to put no more on there. And I think this is kind of sheer anyway, uh, to be honest. Because um, once I use my brush, it just kind of, it, it's not as bright as it is when I use my fingers. However, I can probably just use my fingers and it will be more intense. But, however, I don't want it too intense. You know, I don't, really don't want it really intense. Just enough to show it's good enough. Now, I'm just blending it, blending this cream blush on out. Going back in with the bronzer, this is how it's looking. Going back with the bronzer, I'm going to put my bronzer back underneath my cheeks, just slightly below it, because when I put that on, it kind of took some of my bronzer off. Alright, that's good enough. Okay, 
Now we're ready for lips. Okay. On my lips, I think I can't make up my mind what I want to use. Um, there's two beautiful colors. Let me just take a look at it. I don't know which one to go with. Uh, it's just so, so pretty. Both shades. Let me see. Okay, I done made up my mind that fast. I think I'm going to go with this one. Alright, let me line my lips. I'm going to line my lips with the L'Oreal Crayon Automatic Lip Liner in Warm Corals. Looks like this. And yes, if you don't know already, I'm going with a real bright lip. Okay, there's the liner. Hold on. Okay, there's the liner. Okay, give me a second. And I'll tell you what I'm using on my lips. Oh, this is so pretty. Just a minute. Okay, you guys. Here we go. Okay, here we go, you guys. This is the look. I will zoom you in. Alright, this is the look. Um, I love it. The lipstick that I went with was the City Color Color Play. It doesn't have a color name, but I had hauled it. It was in a set from City Colors. I love this lipstick you guys look at this that is so bold but so beautiful I got it on my teeth okay alright that is so bold and so beautiful I just love it okay so I'm going to close my eyes so that you can see my eyes that's what's going on. I decided to stay with the smoky eyes, but with the pop of color right there on the lid. But actually like a, a shimmer color, actually, on the lid. And then I wanted to go with a more bolder lip, and I did. And I love this. I just think it's so pretty. I love the entire look. I like this blush. 
So yeah, you guys, let me just pull this down, pull my hair down just a little bit. Give me a second. Maybe I can look a little bit complete. All right. I had it fixed earlier, but you know. All right. So this is the look. So I hope y'all enjoyed this look. Let me pull you back out. See which way do I go? Nope, the other way. All right. So I hope you enjoyed this look. I love it. I think it's beautiful. Um, it would be very beautiful for a date night. I would definitely wear my makeup like this. So yes. And this lipstick is banging. It is like super, super intense. I love it with the eyes being smoky and the light blush on my cheeks with a little bit of contouring going on and highlighting so yeah you guys i'm gonna let y'all go and remember my videos you can expect a video on monday wednesday and thursday and then on friday saturday sunday and tuesday i could come in and just do any kind of video but you can look forward to a video monday wednesday and thursday okay i hope you enjoyed this makeup tutorial and yes y'all have a wonderful evening and remember I love you. Bye-bye. <laughs>